All right. Uh, I have no idea how long this is going to load. I have no idea what's going to happen. I haven't played this version of the game before. Um, the only one I've actually play played... The only one I've actually played is Sony Hunters 2 in this version. This is the HD re-release of... Which, amazingly, it's, I think it's actually running in... Let me check. 1080p right now, actually. Um, which is kind of mind-boggling. Yeah, 1080p. Look at that. But it's kind of amazing to me that it's running in 1080p because I didn't expect it. So yeah, this is Zone of the Enders 1. I'm going to play number 2 as well. Uh, I'm So, I'm really good at Metal Gear Solid games. It just isn't coming through right now with Metal Gear Solid 3 because, I've, I've, like I said, three years. I haven't played this game in forever to ever as well. Wait. Who is that? I want to see. Okay, never mind. Yeah. So yeah, this is the... Oh, it's starting to rain outside. That's unfortunate. I'm going to close the window. And it's really warm in here because it was just super hot earlier and now it's getting cold. So yeah, Viola is controlling this... Oh, what's the name of this one? It's been so long. But she is controlling that one there. Not... Okay, Vic Viper is a different one. <laughs> I'm spoiling the game! Um, but Viola is the bad guy, and right now they're heading here to find, uh, as you saw the thing that says Ada, they're finding Ada, essentially. Uh, you, you pilot the big giant robot Jehuti. Or Jehuti, or however you pronounce it. I say Jehuti. Like, yeah. And if I remember correctly, that is Leo Stenbach. Or is it Steinbach? I think it's Stenbach. And that is Zone Enders 1. This is the protagonist you play as, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah, Zone of the Enders. <gasps> you son of a bitch. Kisama! Boy of Enders, yeah. Zone of the Enders kinda has. Yeah, Zone of the Enders. Is really. I guess I completely forgot about this part. Yeah, I guess Zone of the Enders was like this is the zone where they live in this orbital space station. It's around Jupiter, as you saw the planet there. Um, I'm trying to remember this all as I'm playing, uh, as I'm watching this. And you play Leo, who. Yeah, oh yeah, Viola showed up, I think. This is just flashback of what happened. Yeah, there's the Lev units, I believe. Oh man, this has been way too long. I have, I beat this game once, and then, like, I beat this... I think... After Zone Enders 2, or was it before Zone Enders 2? But I beat this one... Roughly... Yeah, and then all his friends. Nani! And... Yeah, so the Lev unit. Falls and kills his friends right in front of him. And I believe that's where he's running from. And the love units are very clunky, clunky ones. There's also high mobility frames, uh, which is Jehuti, I believe. I think she's called a high, high mobility frame. And there's Viola there is also a high mobility frame. What is... Yeah. <laughs> Blood. What are they called? Ah, oh, man, it's been way too long. I love this game, though! <laughs> Because there's also the unmanned ones, of course. Because you can't kill people. And it has tits. Her robot has tits. I, I, I can... I've taken control of Nef... Nef... Nefestus? Nefer... I can't remember her, its name. Yeah. The, all, most of the... Or some of the... I'm waiting to die. I'm a punk bitch. Um, a lot of the names are of like Egyptian things. Is it Nef Nefer? I can't remember his name. And those are your generic ones. I can't remember their names. It's like I said, it's been a few years since I played Zone Ninjas 2 even, and I love that one. So they're here looking for something. It's an orbital frame, I believe is the name. And 
Leo just happens to see it. And of course the cockpits are cocks. So Jehudi, you sit in a dick. Oh yeah. The explosion just, by chance, the explosion puts you right next to the cockpit. And because you touch it, oh. oh okay, I thought it immediately happened because you touched it. Yeah, a few of them, okay, let's see, I remember those ones are just generic orbital frames. Then there's like the mummies and things like that later on. Which one are you? Oh, there we go. Because he closed his eyes, I guess. And whoop! I think it'd be pretty cool if they actually changed the art style so it was C, uh, CG, or not CG, cell shaded, like Zone Enders 2. Zone of the Enders 2 has one of those really well done cell shading graphics, I think. One of the better ones in the industry, I'd even say, in terms of video games. Ada. Ready for combat operation. Move! Oh wait, no, that's Dingo. <laughs> oh, no, they didn't. Okay, they're using that graphic style. Ka-chunk, ka-chunk, ka-chunk. And this is never getting a third game, which is so sad. Ah, uh, if Hideo. Yeah, there you go. So that's Jehuti, the most powerful robot in the universe, pretty much. If Jehuti were actually given, um, or, uh, oh, what's his dick? Did I win? Did I win? Yay! Who are you? I am Ada, yeah. advanced battle computer of this Jehuti. Jehuti. Um, yeah, but if... If they... I, 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 could, I think Hideo Kojima could actually make a... Second or a third game, but not call it Zone Enders. Call it something different, just so they're not, like, infringing on... Konami bullshit copyright stuff. For that, Konami, of course, would automatically pull because they're Apollo Dex. Please. And then this is your, yeah, your tutorial of, here's how you do all this stuff. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> this is the end of the training session. I'm going to learn as I go. So this is on normal as well, by the way. Uh, one of the things when I get to it as well, okay, that's, that's Metatron. Yeah. Um, it's power. It's energy source. Where will Metatron take our society? It's, I think, or something like that. Here, let me just uh, get acquainted with the controls. X is down, triangle is up. Square is just your generic attack. If you attack up close, you um, you do uh, sword blade, sword stuff. Circle is your sub. There's your charge, which then you get a spirit bomb. And if you're close to someone and do that, you get a. Um, what's the term here I'm looking for? Oh, guard. There we go. You a dick! But if you... Can I lock? No? Okay. If you guard, you get the ability... Or not guard. Um, if you're up close and you use the boost attack there, you actually get a little, like, spinny one. Move outside. And this is... So, if I remember correctly... This game, um, in terms of how it plays, is a little different from Zone Enders 2. In Zone Enders 2, if I remember correctly, it's like you just fly around and you can do the missions as you as they pop up, like, we need help here, help us, and then you can go there and help. Yeah, there's a Jupiter. Hey, buddies. Yeah, okay, so these are your generic orbital frames. Yeah, one sec, let me, uh... I don't... Do I not have a dash yet? I actually don't have a dash yet. That's actually weird. Oh, there we go. Much better. Spirit Bomb! Which breaks shields. Yeah, okay, these are the mummies. Mummy heads, whatever. Or are they called the phalanx in this one? I don't know. Yeah, there we go. That's that's how it's done. 
And if you act, I like this about the game is uh oh. Shut up. Damn it. Yeah, there we go. Let's just spin attack. I have detected a type C orbital frame. Type C orbital frame, yeah. Nah, god damn, what's her name? Bitch. Get ready! What is Okay. And I think Ah lasers! Yeah. I think you're actually just gonna survive long enough. Come on, you can't win. I've killed you multiple times in Zone Enders 2. And yeah, like they did an increase in damage for Zone the Enders. Um, Zone the Enders 2, they did a huge increase in difficulty. Holy hell. What? Are you crazy? It's just a kid. But it's in Jehuti. Even without weapons. I repeat, evacuate now. You didn't even touch me. That was weird. You embarrassed me this time. Not Hephaestus. Hephaestus was a forge. Uh he he was the forge god basically. Boy. Meph. Oh. That's the one that killed his friends. I can detect no sign of vital activity. You mean that everyone is dead? That is correct. Good work, <laughs> No! <laughs> yeah, I forgot about this. This is Noman to all units. Oh, I forgot Noman is actually in this! Oh, great. Yeah, Noman's the big bad guy. Now start destroying the nearby buildings. This is Night Raid. I've also arrived at Sector 05. Uh, is that actually Noman, or is that Viola still? Yeah, that's correct. That's Viola. Viola, report your current status. No need for that. You know what happened. <laughs> Don't be so harsh. Your turn will come. Just be patient. And I'll kick your ass. Oh my god, it's gonna bug me. Nefertos. It's some Egyptian word. I don't think Jehuti is actually an Egyptian thing. I know a Nomans is Anubis. And that is not giving away any story elements. He just calls himself Anubis. Or that's what it is, Anubis. And Viola's orbital frame. Your mental condition has reached a level of minus eight. Your combat operation will suffer substantially at this level. <laughs> I you to take some medication to stabilize your condition. Viola Guyana, uh, Baram. is declining. Nithera. Yeah. This is Atlantis. Whoever is aboard Jahuti. It's not Atlantis. Viola. There she is. Is a foxy, foxy anime character. Twenty to thirty. Do you read me? Oh, I can understand how you must feel. <laughs> Listen to me, boy. Boy. I saw everything you did on my monitor. Okay. I also know that you're just a juvenile civilian, and you've done all of this. But I didn't have any other choice. It's fine. I, scared. I, couldn't help I think most of the I'm frames are unmanned anyways. You proved you can operate the system. Listen, I must ask um, you to do something for us. Can you deliver that orbital frame to our base? What? We are a civilian transportation company, and we've been asked to carry that orbital frame. Jehuti oh, yeah, that's I didn't you see any of our people in the vicinity of Jehuti? I think I, don't know. I can't remember if that comes I up at number two or not. There. He's the frame runner we sent there. I said I don't know, didn't I? By the time I got there, everyone was dead. Aww. I see. He was supposed to operate that frame. Now we need your help. I cannot remember the name. Where is it? Neftis. Neftis. That's the name. Found it finally after five hours. Christ. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, so you're... I don't want to. I... There's a thing in this game, and it's not really well explained, but it's like, it's there, like... And who the hell are you? I think it's called cast system or whatever, but like, like the, um... The different levels of society, and there's the enders, which is like, I guess, these guys here, which is the bums. 
kill again. Well, Aww. I have nothing more to do with any of you. Go Aww. Kill See, this is already like. Just leave me out of it. This, I love this because right at the beginning, it's like starting off with the um. What? Yeah, it's starting off with the "I'm not a murderer." Don't make me do it. And it's like immediately like, "Yeah, you gotta kill people." <laughs> Sorry. We can't let them get a hold of Jehuti. Jehuti. It is Jehuti. Look at that. No, it may be the end of civilization as we know it. Which, you must number two, not spoiling that, never mind. <laughs> it kind of comes to that, actually, number two. Oh, yeah, his memories are attacking him. But how? I can't drive this thing. Yes, you can. I saw you do it. you can do it again. It's because you have a whole bunch of, uh... You have Ada helping you. Do, do, do. All right. Ah. I'll do it just this one time, but that's all I'll do. Okay, that's all we ask. Yeah. If you say so. Thank you. I wonder if, they can, I wonder if Hideo could actually make another one in this sort of in the Zone of the Enders universe, but not Zone of the Enders. Maybe killing is all right for you people, but it's not with me. Don't worry, Leo. I'll get you used to it fast. So, we have a business deal. <laughs> In charge is oh, good. Right the mic or no? Oh, it's my beard. Never mind. <laughs> my beard is quite a massive, so touching it uh, feels quite yes. Okay, Leo. I'm Elena Weinberg. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's a fake name. Just call me Elena. It's not. No. I can I'll call really you Ted. You. Can't I? Well, we don't kill indiscriminately, as you seem to think. Ah, uh, you say that, but those kids were killed underneath your lev unit. And that is, yeah, that's where the kids were sitting when they got crushed to death, easy death. Can I do anything else? Can I... No? Okay, I can just look around. And I think that's the thing generating the shield around here that gives us atmosphere. However, Jehuti has just had an overhaul. And therefore has only minimum system capabilities. Hey! Yeah, that's how they, they it's your metal uh your Metroid. How many function modules we can install? First of all, we need to transplant the necessary modules from the local server in this area. Let me Ah god, my jaw's still killing me, man. You are to proceed to that location. Um and then yeah, this is, I is this I can't remember if this is the only way to unlock stuff or not. And I can't remember if there's actually pickups or anything around here. It's been a very, very long time since I've played this game. Is there a controls option? We are heading for the, we are heading for the outer area of the battle zone. Huh. Oh, is that one? This local server is different. A similar type of local server is on the roof oh. of the giant hangar where Jehuti is located in the center of the industrial area. Move there. Fine. I'm just looking for pickups. Jeez, bitch. Because there's always, like, there's sometimes, uh, I'll bring that up in Zoniators too. But there are pickups and things. Hey, look, there's another one. Oh, I actually can't. Shit. Okay. Yeah. We have obtained the program. Monitor. It enables us to fight against more than one enemy at a time. A lock on related operation has been newly added. Let me bring nice. to explain this operation. And I think this is another the tutorial video. <laughs> or tutorial thing, yeah. Move, dash, dash, attack, burst, blah, 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 camera version. Good and training. This is the end of the training session. I don't need that. I've never been in this game, so there should be a few pop trophy pop-ups. There's probably a trophy for actually doing all the uh, tutorials, but the couldn't care less. The have obtained allows us to select the command menu by pressing the start button. You can save the current status by choosing save. Oh! Did not... whoops. Programs. Oh, I forgot about this stuff. No weapons yet. Ah, come on. And every enemy does give you a EXP. We will cease battle position. We will hold battle position. Colony damage increasing due to battle. Shut up. There's no one here. Pass code level one. Yeah. Um. 
in the second game. Yeah, see, so here's the thing is like there is, these guys have a passcode, that's right, they have a code to something. In the second game, when you have your full power up, and that'll come up later as well again, uh, you get the ability to like, you can just do this as you walk around and it actually kills guys. So that bar underneath my uh, health there is actually an experience bar. Shut up, bitch. And the... It'll actually level you up. Okay, let's, let's hit this one. What's this do? We have obtained the program. Global? We have obtained the flying mode module. Ah, there we go. To other areas. And that's how you do that. Yeah. From the menu. So this is your sort of like... Yeah, I'm not going to do that yet. I'm going to kill these guys. I think the passcode is what you need to leave this area. And that's Metatron. Spirit Bomb! There we go. And, nope. Whoosh, and when they're blocking, if you do the heavy attack, of course, it kills them dead. Metatron. There we go. And I think that's all the anemones. I can also do this, though, and just break stuff, because you dick! There's no one here. I'm allowed to do this. Yay, I'm Leo Stenbuck, hero. Yay, Leo. Sorry. There we go. Looks so much better in the other game. Let's see what I mean when I get there. I have no idea how long this game is. I've completely forgot. I beat it once. That was it. That was I. I can do whatever I want, bitch. I'm just trying to have some fun. I'm trying to remember how everything works. Okay, so weapons, programs, yeah, global, flight mode, and scan. Uh, wait, how does that work again? Scouting mode module can open command menu by pressing start. Oh, okay, so it basically gives me this, and I think in here I can, yeah, see, I can't change, you don't get to change the controls. And mission? What was that one again? Oh, yeah, area change. Yeah. And boop. And then you shift into flying mode. Oh, just get an erection. That's great. And then you can just, I think if I remember correctly, yeah, you just see this. It is residential block S02. I assume it is being attacked by orbital frames. Oh no. Residential block S02? That's where I live. <laughs> yeah, so now you get to... It's really... There we go. It's no man's sky ask in terms of flying. Whee! And you just press X and you land in there. And that's it. You just fly around and then things will happen. And you just go when you sort of fight. And that's that's most of the game, actually. It's... I think it's relatively short, actually. If I remember correctly. Oh, the flamethrower dude! I think he's in the second game as well. Father, I detect no human activity. You mean everyone Father! Is dead. That is a possibility, but it is more natural to assume the residents were previously evacuated. Damn it. Damn it. I detect vital activity. I will zoom up on subject. Whoop. Oh, <gasps> a girl. Selvis. Oh, do you know this person? I do know her. Yes. My wife, my sister, my sister wife. Yeah, that'll help in space. I'm surprised we haven't started colonizing other planets yet. Weird. Jody? Salvis, get out of my dick. I mean, get in the dick. I mean, Salvis, Jody, let's go! Are you alright, Salvis? Leo? Is that you, Leo? Nadesu Onich? What are you doing here? You are going to go to the shelter immediately. But the children may still be in the church. So. You're going to the church? That's impossible! It's suicide to even try! Fucking uh. <laughs> What? Are you crazy? There'll be no I'll protect you, come on. Anyway. But you can't know for certain unless you go. Well, let's go then, Forget bitch. Get in. Them. You can't <gasps> do anything if you die too. Well, I'm not dead yet. Aw. <laughs> Just get in the cockpit. 
jump in with her. Like, it's, there's, got enough, there's enough room for two people, and I know for a fact. Huh. Who is it? Is it mm, Viola? Or is it the guy with the flamethrower thingy? Oh, yeah, go to the church. There he is. You're the runner of Bravo? That frame's not a kid's toy. Get out of there now. I'm not a kid. There's the proof that you still are a kid. I think this kid, this guy's a number two. <laughs> I think so. 